I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Freaked out a little bit? That was a little scary, wasn't it? Well, then you're obviously not an infant, because they love that stuff for some reason. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Hi. See? Honestly, at what point does that switch happen? You go from a little baby that when you hear, I'm gonna get you, you're like... Then you're older and it's like, I'm gonna get you. Yeah, who knows. So I was perusing the World Wide Web, and I read an article about something quite preposterous. A ban on small-breasted women in adult publications has been made by the Australian Classification Board, allegedly on the grounds that such images could be construed as child pornography, even where those publications comply with American law and keep certification that performers are over 18. Huh. Such images could be considered child pornography just because girl has small boobly doobly's? That is ridiculous. Preposterous. Asterisk. Sounds like that means the same thing, but I don't think it does. Last time I checked, the qualifying factor in whether something's child pornography or not is if the person is a child or under 18. Small boobs need loving too. And if this goes through, what's next? You, you can't see this movie. It's rated R and you're only an A. Look, I understand, but the rules state to view a rated R film, a female patron must have C cups or be accompanied by a woman with D's or higher. You have neither. I understand you're 38, I understand, but your boobs say otherwise and I'm not gonna let a toddler in, okay? There's a play place on the other end of the mall, please. We have customers to get to, thank you. Whew, thank God this isn't happening in the US. My favorite adult actress, she's 89, but she got small boobs, so she'd have to quit. Thank God that's not gonna happen. Maybe if the Australians government, uh, if their committee meets with the itty bitty titty committee, they'll get it to be overruled. We can only hope. What's that? How do I have music playing in my video? Allow me to explain. This is a picture of a man taking a walk. This is a harbor. This is a city. And this is the CD cover for the band Walk Harbor City's EP. See how that all segued together? That means segue. You see, the drummer of the band is my friend Sean, and the band let me use the music in my video. Take that, YouTube copyright. I have permission. Their second EP is on iTunes. They're actually really, really good. So check them out. Their links are in the sidebar uh, to their MySpace and to iTunes. Their EP is under three bucks. So really, what do you get to lose? Speaking of losing something, did you know you could get a certificate proving that you're a virgin? Yeah. Here's a picture from the website you can get one from. They show people of all ages holding these I'm a virgin certificate, but if my mom comes through the door and hangs that bad boy on the wall, I'm gonna have a few questions. Was I adopted or am I the son of God? I'm leaning towards the latter of the two, personally. Now if I could only find a website that somehow proves I'm not a virgin. Not that I would need that. No, I wouldn't have to prove it. It's for my friend, uh, think of a name, think of a name. Chris. Ah, damn it. The upside to the website is all their money and uh, proceeds go to AIDS research, so that's pretty cool. And it's only like a buck. What do you get to lose? Your virginity? <laughs> Did I already make that joke? Moving on. Ugh, gross. My coffee is ice cold. Oh, what's that? I asked for iced coffee? Well, in that case, actually, this is delicious. How do you feel about small boobs being banned from pornography? Leave a comment. Let me know. Thanks, guys. Peace.